Hey guys, welcome to a commentary. If you guys read in the description, this is about camping. Because I just wanted to talk about it just a little bit. Because I decided to try it once on Advanced Warfare because Advanced Warfare is definitely a tough game to get your kill streaks. Uh, just in general. And plus, I, you know, I, even I struggle, even right now I'm struggling to try to get a good gameplay for you guys. And I just wanted to do a commentary about, you know, does Advanced Warfare kind of support camping? And in a way, yes, but it also it has to do with skill. So it's just, you know, I don't know. I, I just don't really, I don't know how to say it. That's this bad shooting right there. I mean, I tried this game. I knew I, I like this map to a point, but I also don't like this map because it's way too big. This is a map that I mean, you can hide anywhere, and it's kind of like, how? I mean, without getting yourself killed by just walking down, I don't know, one of the one of the paths. You know, anywhere on here, you can pr get killed. But yeah, just because of campers and and people just sit in the corners like I'm doing right now, right there, just waiting for people to come by. I mean, I'm looking at the mini map and I'm waiting for people to come by, but I want to see how big of a kill streak I can get. I want to see how far I can go. And this one I end up doing pretty well, so just because I don't like the map, you know, I, it's just, it's, I like a rush map. I like at least an in-between map for the most part. And by the way, I'm using my Battle 27 uh, Obsidian Steed here, and I'm going to do an elite uh, class for it. I'm just still working on it. Still trying to get a good game, but I still think the ASM1 Speakeasy is the best game. The ASM1 is the best gun, I mean, uh, by far. I mean, I feel like I can win more ma uh, gun matches, I guess because I'm more of a rusher or in between guy than a guy who with an assault rifle. Assault rifle is good for mid range to long range, but I mean, it's like, you know, I just can't do it. But, I mean, even in this video though, I mean, what do you guys think? I mean, tell me, what do you guys think about about camping I mean is it something that I mean hey, as long as you're getting the caps I mean I'm playing domination here as long as I'm getting the caps and the uh, and the kills is it okay you know is it helping my team out uh, I end up getting I think the second highest on the team for caps on this so I wasn't like not doing my part it's just there is a you know I don't know I was just trying to get, you know, as much of my streaks as I can. Like, I got the Warbler right there. I wish I was bringing four score streaks on this one. I really wish I would have. I probably would have. Who knows how good I would have done it. But, uh, anyways, I'm bringing three score streaks in this one. I'm bringing the Bombing Run, the uh, Assault Drone, and the Warbird. So, it's in. I mean, it's just. I don't know. Like I said, I mean, right, this map right here, who does not promote this map? The sit in the back. And just wait for people to come. I mean, especially with this. I mean, you get the A flag. Okay, I can support. I can uh, defend the A flag right here. The B flag. They usually are push up anyways to that uh, the point on the other side. So it's kind of like you can just camp in the cave. Uh, the other side is more wide open, so you can't really camp on that side. You could behind that big crane thing, uh, but honestly, more people would probably see you. So, anyways, I I don't know. I mean, what do you guys think? I'm just trying to think of a. There's one in the open. I mean, I, I just I don't like camping. I mean, this was I just don't like the map, and I just wanted to see how I many kills I can get without dying. I mean, I was lucky enough too that the guys didn't cap their A flag uh, right after we capped our flag. So I got two caps within a matter of a minute. Got 400 extra points for my score streaks, and I'm just like, okay, let me just see what happens. And that's basically what I did this whole entire episode, or this whole entire time I played. Because I just felt like I just want, you know, just get get my my kill streaks up or whatever. And uh, but I mean it, overall, I mean I didn't do bad or team one. Uh, you know, can't really complain other than just me sitting back and not doing anything. I mean I'm getting my kill streaks and I'm getting you know defending my A flag, so I guess I'm. Am doing something for the team, but you know, I don't know. I just don't like campers. I really don't. I don't like people. I mean, I'm not sitting. At least I'm not sitting in the corner. There you go. At least I'm not really. I'm moving all the way in the back and forth in the back part, but I'm not just sitting in the corner waiting for some guy to walk by and come get me. So that's one thing I don't like. I mean, when I rush, usually I get killed by guys who either have a shotgun 
<coughs> or they're camping in a corner and they don't want to die. And another thing too with advanced warfare, I always get put on the crappiest teams ever. I mean, I I got, I'll get, I'll go like, I don't know, if it's a bad game, I'm doing like a two to two point five KD, and I'm I'm leading the team by. I mean, doubling their points, doubling their kills, everything. Domination. And I'm just like, I can't do it. I just can't do it. I mean, it just drives me nuts that I can't I can't Capture win a game. My, my win-loss ratio on this is like 0.6. It is really, really bad. They always put me on a, like, the worst team. Everybody else just wrecks us. So, and there you go. I just got my streaks again. I love these streaks. By the way, guys, I mean, if I'm using just for kills, these three streaks I will use. I might start using the Paladin. I think that might be a good switchover. I might take off the uh, the bomber. Uh, maybe. No, I actually might. I might take. Uh, I don't know. Should I take off the assault drone or should I take off the bomber? I'm gonna keep the warbird. I can put the Paladin on. Oh wait, wait a minute. I might not do the Paladin because I think the Paladin cannot be AI controlled. I think you have to control it no matter what. I have to look into that. Hmm, that's good. That's good to think about. I'm just try to get more kill streaks. I mean, get get more kills. I mean, these three streaks do pretty well. You know, my other classes, I usually run the uh, the uh, UAV and run it with thermo and, and extra time. So I don't know. I just gotta see what uh, what I can do here. What are we on, anyways? I don't even know what, what how many kills we're on right there. Got two right there, three right there, no, two, two, 27 and 0, so I'm on 27 <coughs> kills for excuse me. <coughs> but, I don't know guys, I mean, it's, to me it's promoted, I love Black Ops 2, Our UAV is online. Uh, because yeah, I can yeah. rush, there are campers, but it's not as bad as this. Uh, Black Ops 2, I feel like I can rush around and do pretty well, and not, uh, and I get myself killed, I can actually win the gunfights more than likely. On this, it seems like I can get one or two kills and then die if I don't uh, camp or slow it down a little bit. I can't rush in advanced warfare. I mean, I can't take out three guys in a room. Like, on, was it comeback? If they're all on B flag on comeback, and there's three guys standing there, and I try to take all three at once, can't do it. Cannot do it. So, it's. I don't know, I just have a hard time getting like a, unless I'm behind them somehow, I might be able to do it. Usually by the time that happens, the third guy turns around and kills me uh, because he already knows his guys next to him are dying. So I don't know, I mean, it might be all that skill matchmaking stuff. And I don't know, I mean, I, I love the game. I think if they actually kept the skill matchmaking out and kept it like Black Ops 2 or Ghost, uh, it would be a lot more fun. I do like the... The exosuits, I do like the way things move, I do like how things are going. Uh, with this game, the graphics are really good, the gun ideas, the supply drops are real good. You know, I think overall they did a really good job uh, overall with the game. I think the only thing I have a problem with, with Sledgehammer, they should have done gun game and party games and stuff like that at the beginning. That's my only thing. Uh, gun game is a major thing that they can actually have people use more than one gun. Without gun game, people are used the Bell 27 the whole time, or the ASM1, or like, or you know, a couple, a couple of uh, a streaks, or, you know, or guns. I mean, oh, there's my vicious. I got vicious middle. So it, it, you know, it's just they made some mistakes, but overall, the I think the game was a success. A success. I think they did a really good job. I think they actually uh, deserve a a high five for this. I don't uh, I mean, there's always stuff to work on. There's always stuff that people are not happy with. But I think overall, I think they did a great job with this game. I don't see them, uh, I think, this is this is it. Yeah, I think, yeah, right there. I get, finally get shot in the back. I went on a 31 gun streak, which I was thrilled about. Or not gun streak, kill streak. But uh, anyways, guys, I mean, it, it is what it is. I mean, I, I definitely like the game. I hope you guys do too. Uh, let me know how you guys are doing. What do you guys think? Are you guys rushing? Are you guys camping it out a little bit more? Just trying, I mean, like, Domination, you can camp. TDM, you cannot camp. They'll find you real quick and kill you. 
you know, but at least Domination, you know where they're going to spawn easier. You know, TDM is, is you know, shot in the back all the time. Yeah, yeah, you know, all sorts of stuff. The spawns are horrible on, on TDM. But the game's coming in here to an end here, guys. I didn't do too bad uh, for camping. What I, I think I went... We'll find out here in a minute. Uh, but, I mean, I, at least I, you know that if you can hold down one side in domination, you'll be able to get your kill streaks in and get your vicious, vicious, and also maybe even get your DNA bomb if you're lucky. But guys, we're coming to the end of the video here. I hope you guys enjoyed my commentary over it. Uh, I went 34 and 2. They said, look, four caps, and the top guy had five caps. So, and I had more kills than anybody else on the whole game. <clears throat> so, anyways, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys did, hit that like button, and I hope you guys have a great day and great gaming. And I'll see you guys next time. See ya!